Hi, Dennis Ray here. Audacious is a free program that's an excellent music or audio program for PCs that uses very little computer resources, has many great features, and has superb sound. Let's look at Audacious. This is the interface for Audacious. Uh, the menu have file, playback, playlist, services, output, and view below that. The controls, uh, search library, open files, add files, and then your standard controls for players. And the slide showing the progress of the song, countdown for the time, the total time of the song. This is repeat, shuffle, and volume control, uh, title, artist, album, cue number, length, and then this area will show song information and meter. And then this will have the countdown again and the length of the song. Let's look at the file menu. Um, most of these are pretty well self-explanatory, but we'll look at settings in appearance. Uh, right now it's in QT mode. Uh, which is the dark appearance that you see back here. And we can restart this in the GTK legacy mode. So if I hit this, we'll get this, which I don't think looks as good as the QT mode. So we'll go back to the QT mode when we hit this. And we're back into QT mode. Then there is the interface, and uh, right now in QT interface, uh, which looks very similar to uh, FUBAR 2000, I think. And then uh, we can change this actually to Winamp Classic Interface, which looks like this, the same look and feel as Classic Winamp. The rest of the items are pretty well self-explanatory in here. Then we'll move on to the audio tab. Uh, these items are self-explanatory. But I do want to touch on replay gain. Replay gain is a way of normalizing songs so that all the songs are the same volume. And uh, the way to do it is fairly simple. I did a video on how to do it. You can see the description below for a link for the video and then there's prevent clipping and that's a way of preventing distortion for the songs okay moving on network pretty well self-explanatory playlist nothing too far out there <clears throat> song information uh, fairly easy to understand plugins also pretty well self-explanatory there's a visualization or you can select these in then there's advanced which uh, I would only select these if you know what you're doing uh, a little beyond the scope of this video so not for the faint of heart to be healthy and fit like me you must pump like and subscribe hear me now believe me later Get ready to pump, like, and subscribe. Start now. Pump. One, two, three. Like. One, two, three. Subscribe. One, two, three. Good. Do this every day. Don't forget. Show your leadership skills. Let's go back to the Audacious menu in playback. It has some player controls and some shuffle and repeat commands. In playlist, it has controls to play playlists, sort, create new playlists, remove, import, and export lists, a playlist manager, and a queue manager. Services has controls to play or add a CD, and a link that takes you to the plugins list in settings. 
output has volume control and equalizer, a link to effects to be able to record stream, and a link to audio settings. View is where you can select the items to be visible on the main window and a link to visualizations in settings. Let's see what Audacious sounds like with a piece of music that I got from the YouTube library. And at the same time, we can take a look at the visualizations that uh, come with it too. sounded pretty good and I like the visualizations. You may be wondering where can I get Audacious? Well I thought you'd never ask. This is the website and I'll put a link for this in the description below. The home page has information about Audacious. Uh, it's free, it's open source, uses very little of your computer resources. And there's a link to download Audacious for Windows, there are the two links. You can either download a zip file or an exec file. Unfortunately, there's only a 32-bit version. And uh, once you have the file and you've extracted your zip file, if that's what you have, it's a fast and easy install. That was Audacious, an excellent audio player. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you later. Take care.